and welcome back for another episode of Ben Roland playing the Old Republic. I need to do a few more things before we can get off this planet. And it looks like the first one is I have to go over here to turn in a quest. Oh, just not to him. Um, looks like I have to kill some guys. Okay. You're gonna get it now. You're gonna get it, Mister. fight. That's what it looks like, but just in case, as always, we have to be a little cautious. Okay, now we can uh, <laughs> celebrate a victory and get Mako some new gear. Uh, what am I doing? That's what I'm doing. Ooh. Now she's got a cape. Okay. Wait, wait, what? Why is it saying that there's... You know what, who cares? Certainly not me. <sighs> Alright, I need to uh, go this way now. At least according to the map. In order to turn in the crown. Point. Destination. Tag. Enjoy your stay. Let's probably tag all this. And he wants us to do something. Ah, so you're here now too. Soon everyone will know that House Pantia wasn't wiped out when House Olgo invaded and took their castle. Inside, political leaders from House Thul and House Organa stumble over each other to win Pantia's favor and a future crown. The inner workings of the Alderaan houses put me to sleep. I am of like mind, believe me, but these details directly inform my job. I am General Gavir, commander of the 3rd Battalion, and I'm taking it upon myself to win House Pantia's allegiance to the Empire. House Organa has just launched a surprise attack to liberate Castle Pantia from the occupying Algo forces. Thal's leaders were planning a similar campaign, but Organa has beaten us to it. If they succeed, House Pantia will be beholden to Organa. If your house was too slow to act, you only have yourselves to blame. I agree. Rather than implore Thal leadership to act, I should do it myself. My men already march on the castle, preparing to decimate the Organan offensive. You could attack before they arrive, ensuring a Thal victory. Wipe out enough Organa forces so that defeat is imminent. Their failure will expose them as weak to Pantia. That seems simple enough. If you're up to it, I have another wrinkle. 
While there, if you could take a large enough bite out of Ogo, you'll make our cleanup that much easier. But Agana's failure is paramount, so concentrate your effort on their ranks and see me when you're done. Uh, of course. Gotta keep it interesting. Alright, looks like uh, both of our turn ins are here. Let's talk to Captain Lieber. Captain, I admire your principles, but it is clear Organa offers no help on what matters most to House Pantier. You need not try to sell me again on House Thule Fixer. But who is this? What do you want with the Queen's Guard, stranger? I recovered this from the river. You know what it is. That's... that is quite frankly unbelievable. We will, of course, analyze it to determine if it is a fake. Captain, surely this will sway your vaunted neutrality. The Empire and House Thule giving you... The symbolism does not escape me, Fixer. But that crown has never changed hands without enormous cost. What do you seek in return for the crown? An alliance? Or merely a deal? <laughs> Dark side, light side. In the end, what I ask is that the crown go on a fool head. House Thule's crimes are great, but Organa has proven itself no better. To retrieve this must have taken courage. If Thule commands such virtue these days, perhaps we can look beyond old transgressions. You are to be commended. Many in your position would have taken full financial advantage. How fortunate for the Empire it was you who held it. Well, you won't be saying that when it's, uh, huh. some other tune that I have holding it. Uh, we will take that one, I guess. 1218. Why does that not really sound like an upgrade? Eh, whatever. It wasn't exactly hard to get. Good, you've arrived. Allow me to introduce you to Lord Oren Pantier, nephew of the late Queen Celara Pantier. Rightful Queen of Alderaan. Your Lordship, this is the hero I spoke to you about. The one who prevented Ulgo's barbarous attack against your noble house. It is an honor to meet you. My family owes you a great debt. You will always be welcome in the home of Pantir. Making problems go away is what I do best. The elimination of House Ulgo's strike teams has forced them to draw men from their castle guard. The heart of their house lies exposed. Given your exemplary service in defense of House Pantier, Lord Oren has deigned to grant you an opportunity to shape the future of Alderaan. Boris Ulgo, head of House Ulgo, has betrayed the noble laws of Alderaan and stolen the throne for himself. It will be your task to remove it from him. It'd be an honor. Just as I told you, your lordship, the servants of House Thule and its allies are as fearless as they are loyal. So I see, Lord Victus. So I see. Please, do everything within your power to capture Boris Olga alive. The people of Alderaan deserve to see that usurper face justice. They deserve... Begging your pardon, my lord. An urgent matter requires your attention. Very well. Tell me what's happened. Captured alive, you will do no such thing. Even in chains, Boris Ulgo is a threat to House Thule's ascendance. He must be killed at all costs. Isn't it our goal to make Pantier happy? We will be eliminating House Pantier's greatest enemy. That is their only true concern. My apologies. Now, you understand the gravity of the task being given to you, don't you? Boris Ulgo is at the center of a castle stolen from our house, surrounded by an army of loyal troops. Until now... No one has dared challenge his position. I always get my target, period. We waited so long. This will be a momentous day. I must make preparations. I'll arrange for a special detachment of our elite Queen's Guard to move in behind you and collect the usurper once the job is done. Good luck. Do not fail us. What do you say, pale boy? Helmet from Mako. Why is it not showing Mako? Oh, because she doesn't have one, that's right. Derp. Your 
all right. Uh, she can have implants, right? Might as well give her one. I don't see the point in her just having an empty slot. All right. Kill people. Get to the throne room. And that's it. Ooh, that means I get to use bazookas again. <laughs> awesome. Uh, why is it pointing me? Oh, because that's where derp. Never mind. Okay, let's begin our assault on the castle, which is right there, which is why I looked up, in case you weren't aware of why I was looking there, because there's a castle there. Like right there. <laughs> uh, okay, they're friendly. Apparently that's our forces holding the bridge. Uh, oh yeah, I have a skill point. Should probably use that, shouldn't I? Let's see, tracer lock, tracer missiles, grant tracer lock, increasing the damage dealt by the next rail shot by 6%. Stacks, cult of vents, vent heat regenerates 7% of your maximum health. Uh, riddle increases the damage Done, dealt by unload by 33%. Nice upgrade. Pinning fire. Unload has a 50% chance to still to target's movement by 50%. Yeah, we're gonna take unload buff. That seems to 33% uh, uh, damage increase. That's a pretty substantial increase. <laughs> Alright. Now it's time to make our move. the castle. That's right, these guys. Alright, let's deal with you first. Haha, <laughs> I'm out of range for him. He can't move. Oh, can't see me. Thank you. 
what the deuce? No. Yeah, good job, you little turd. You got yourself killed for nothing. Alright, now we got him. Looks like I need a rebuff while I'm at it. Nothing. to head inside the castle. That is how you swat flies in <laughs> for the bounty hunter. Uh, looks like he dropped a green. What the hell was that? Oh, willpower. And lore object. Alright, green door time. Just head on in here. And get to the throne room. And luckily you don't have to worry about anyone attacking you on your way <laughs> into the throne room anyway. You are, uh, well, <laughs> a guest, I suppose. See, they really take care of this place. And here we are. It's just as I predicted. A mere tool of the Sith Empire, just like the beasts in House Thule. Sent to wrench the throne of Alderaan away from those who rightfully possess it. Getting a little nervous? The righteous have nothing to fear from bloodthirsty thugs like you. 
I was the only one strong enough to do what was necessary. The people of this world deserve a leader who will defend them. I will not surrender this throne for you or for anyone else. Only I can keep it safe. Only I can protect Alderaan. Surrender now, and you can face a just trial. I will not be tried when my only crime is defending the people of Alderaan. And she'll touch. Destroy this assassin men! Defend your king! Defend Alderaan! Okay. to break down his shield. And to do that, we have to disable his uh, four generators. So let's get at it. We'll talk later, okay? I'm not trying to talk to you. Alright, to turn off the generator. We'll talk later, okay? You son of a quit it. Alright, picked up a rocket launcher. And That's not a generator, is it? Walk around that one. I think I can avoid them. Nope. You all right? I am perfectly fine. Thank you. Let's get ourselves another rocket. That's Pete. And away we go. Oh, oh, come from that side. Not just the pretty sidekick, Buster. And no loot for you. Oh, 
enemies out of range, that's why. Like, why aren't I firing? Alright. Another rocket. And hello. Okay, don't fire it now. That's cool. Left is the king. Let's go get him. Just the pretty sidekick, Buster. This is not over. I'm not dead yet! I won't let you win. I won't let the Empire's shadow fall over Alderaan. Your fellow nobles can decide your fate. So be it. Let the battlefield change. I will fight to protect Alderaan from the Empire's filth to my last breath, just as I always have. Right. Area secure, everyone. Looks like the hard part's been taken care of. Boris Olgo in the flesh. Wasn't sure if I'd ever have the pleasure. Save your mockery, Pantir. If your house were stronger, we wouldn't be here now. Not very diplomatic for a king. You'll have plenty of time to remember his manners in our holding cells. Lord Oren, the operation was a success. Boris Olgo is in our custody. It's finally over. The usurper will finally face justice. 
You were right, Lord Victus. Our house owes you and House Thule a great debt. Yes, I must admit, even I am surprised that it was possible to capture the usurper alive. I hadn't expected that particular windfall. If Alderaan wants Boris Olgo dead, let Alderaan kill him. That's right. The usurper's fate should be decided and carried out for all to see. You have delivered Boris Ulgo as promised. You have proved House Thule's commitment to the good of Alderaan. So you will have my support. Will your influence be enough to persuade those misled brothers and cousins of yours who have sided with House Organa? I'll do my best, but the Organos may not take well to losing. I fear this conflict could be far from over. If you ever need my help again, you only need to ask. I will certainly be keeping you in mind. Your work is done for the time being. You can go on about your own business. House Pantir will never forget what you've done for us. Thank you. You're damn right. And we'll take another commendation. Alright, so we are done with that and this episode. I thank you for watching me uh, save the planet of Alderaan from, I guess, one king anyway. Who knows what will happen after this, but, you know, you can probably guess from uh, the movies. <laughs> anyway. Uh, please subscribe, comment, share, whatever tickles your fancy, and I will see you next time.